We have new information on that fatal crash that killed a family of four in Pleasanton. It happened on Wednesday night on Foothill Road, and this evening we have new details about the EV involved and the stretch of roadway that has already claimed many lives before. NBC Bay Area's Damian Trujillo is in Pleasanton with more. Pleasanton police are not releasing much information, only that speed may have been a factor in this accident. This stretch of road is an eerie reminder for one Bay Area mom. Not a day goes by that Ana Reynoso doesn't think about her twin boys. No, every day. And I celebrate them every day as if they were still alive. Michael and Mark and a third teen, Javier Ramirez Jr., died on Christmas night in 2021 on Foothill Road as they were driving to help a friend. The twins were 16 at the time. This morning, Ana heard that another family died on the same road on Wednesday night. Ana calls the news triggering. It was shocking and emotional. Yeah, it's um, very emotional. But you, you just your heart breaks. Chad really hit the on the road. The coroner has not released the names of the victims, only saying they were a family of two adults and two children under 15. Investigators say speed could have played a role as a car hit the curb and then a big oak tree before bursting into flames. Police also identify the car as a VinFast electric vehicle, but we don't know what model. NBC Bay Area has learned that the National Traffic Safety Administration has recalled certain 2023 VinFast models for speedometer and warning light errors. Drivers have also filed complaints with the agency about steering and lane departure issues with the vehicles. But it's unclear which models. The agency denied our request for an interview. Pleasanton police have not mentioned car malfunction as a possible cause. But Anna says don't forget about the risk that comes with the road itself. Issues ranging from speeds to turns to darkness. I, I avoid it. I make sure to avoid it. I try not to go. Tonight, Anna says her heart aches for the family of the latest victims of Foothill Road. My condolences to them. I, I really hope their family heals. And I'm here for anything that they might need. They want to talk. I don't know what else to offer. I just, I'm sorry. Damien Trujillo, NBC Bay Area News.